Hey guys, Sam here from keycommerce.com. In this video, you're going to learn about optimizing your store and why it is so, so, so important to do this rather than just setting up your store and forgetting about it. A lot of people spend a lot of time at the beginning of their e-com journey setting up their store. They spend all this time researching, building their store, getting it to look really, really nice, and then they set it up and forget about it. Once they set it up, they then focus entirely on traffic. This is not good. You should be optimizing and improving your website every single week. Yes, get your store built with best practices, but then keep optimizing it again and again. Why do you need to do this? Why do you need to optimize? Well, you can watch all my videos and learn the strategies that are working for e-commerce stores. And yes, that's really gonna help you in your journey to build a successful e-com store. But the huge growth, the huge amount of sales, the huge increase in your conversion rate only comes when you really focus on your unique store and optimizing it for your customers. This is because your customers are unique. Whatever niche you're in, your customers are unique. Even compared to your competitors, your customers are unique. And because of this, you need to keep optimizing. Your store should be constantly changing and improving based on your customer data. Maybe your customers like certain colors, certain fonts, certain brands, certain products. You need to constantly be testing and improving these things for your unique customers. And it's your job as an entrepreneur to find out what these optimizations are, to make these changes, track the results, implement what works and then test something else again and again. This may be a new approach for some of you. Maybe you wish you could just build your store, leave it there and then focus on your ads. But this is not how e-com works anymore, guys. This is not how you succeed. Yeah, you can get some sales by doing this and maybe you'll do pretty well and make some profit straight away. But all it takes is another one of your competitors to watch my videos, implement all these strategies, but then also to go a step further and optimize their store and boom, they jump way ahead of you and take all your customers over a period of months. And I've seen this happen with a few stores and we've done this for our clients too. We've entered some niches where a competitor had 90% of the market, but we implemented our best practices and then optimized the store on an ongoing basis. And within six to 12 months, we had 70% of the market. And do you know what the competitor then did? Instead of testing for their own customers and beating their own path towards optimizing their store, they just turned to our store and tried to copy everything we did. They copied all our branding, all our ads, all our products. But do you know how that worked out for them? They were always three steps behind us constantly, but we were making so much in profits because we were authentic. Our strategies were unique to our customers. Our customers would even talk about that other brand, the competitor, and tell us that they felt that that brand was fake and superficial. This is just one case. And I have a video on my channel where I show you the power of improving your conversion rate. I'll leave a link to that video below. And what I'm teaching you in this video is the absolute secret to improving your conversion rate. It's all about testing. Testing your store again and again. Make a new improvement, test it again with an old version. The idea is that you make more and more positive changes until you create the ultimate product page for your store and your customers. And this is so crucial for you to understand. I can create an amazing product page for you from day one, but it's not gonna be the best until you test and test and test. Why? Because every single store is different and every single base of customers is different as well. And this is why you can't just copy and paste a template of a successful dropshipping store and suddenly be rich. I know a lot of seven and eight figure e-com store owners. Do you know what's similar across all their stores? They were obsessed with testing their site, improving it and creating a better customer experience. So as you go through my YouTube channel, all my videos, my blogs, and my free courses, keep this in mind. Once you get your product page set up and converting, keep making adjustments, improve it, test it, and increase that conversion rate over time. That's it for this video, guys. If it was helpful, I recommend checking out my free course where I show you how to build product pages that convert. I'll leave a link in the top of the description. Give this video a like if it was useful and let me know in the comments below and consider checking out my other videos if you wanna keep learning how to grow your e-com store. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.